Hey, what is up? My name is Rubidium. Today we are talking music, music licensing, and how to find music that will make your projects stand out. So if you've been following this channel for a couple of months, you may remember this video. It was one of the first things that I shot on the C200. Um, looked really, really awesome. I cut together a little edit, edit of it. I put some music that I'd found on a royalty-free music site. Uh, and then I noticed a after a couple of weeks that ads were being played on it, even though I don't monetize my videos. I dug into it and apparently the um, site, which I <laughs> will remain nameless, someone claimed um, rights to this music that I used and they ended up running ads on it and getting paid off my video. YouTube never ceases to amaze me how they handle copyright. Long story short, I just took the video down, which was a shame because I really liked it and I really wanted to get it out into the world. And so when I do buy music for um, projects like my clients' projects or other work I'm looking for, I, you know, I, I kind of surf around a few different um, websites. Premium Beat is one. The problem with Premium Beat is you pay for each track. It's either um, 50 or um, $99 and I think la I looked at my um, accounts and last year I spent almost a thousand dollars on on music I also use a bunch of music from the YouTube um, copyright free library knowing that they can't flag that for um, infringement I felt like the more I do these videos I'd like to find something that I can really rely on so I found a service called Artlist through you know this great film right video um, which is what they use it's a service that's $199 a year uh, for unlimited uh, music that is royalty free that you can use for YouTube, you can use for television, you can use for pretty much anything. And they, when you download songs and tracks from Artlist, they send you the music license. So if anyone should claim copyright, you can sort of have a piece of paper that says, nope, I have the rights to use this video in the way that I'm using it. They range from, you know, kind of the kind of corporate, upbeat, positive, happy edit music that I end up putting on a lot of jobs, too many jobs. Indie rock tracks and folk tracks with vocals, um, which stuff is really hard to find royalty free. Um, you know, some really awesome music and they have all these providers that are constantly uploading tracks. So um, it's not as though you get the one or two tracks that you can use for everything, uh, but you have a really good chance of finding something that fits your project and is also relatively unique. Another good thing about Artlist is they have you know, a sustainable revenue sharing model with their artists. So the people that make the music are actually getting paid. Um, that's as an independent content creator, that's nice to know that you're supporting other artists. So when I, I joined Artlist and I emailed them and said, asked if I could promote them in a video, they sent me a link that I'll put in the comments that gives you two extra months when you sign up for a year. So without further ado, here is the new mix of Baroness Samity, uh, Care of Artlist. <laughs> Thanks very much for all the people that are supporting the channel. The subscriptions are really building and uh, we're getting heaps more views. Really happy to be part of this. I, I, I love making these videos. I hope to keep doing it. Um, see you next time.